Hello friend good evening and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you will be fine there. This is your host Khan Baba. God will give you more happiness and long life. I try to my level best to give you latest update about Iraqi dinar. So please like and share my video with your friend and family which will help me for supporting. And now let's start the today information. The Central Bank of Iraq warns exchange companies against receiving a commission of more than 25,000 from selling the dollar to travelers. As you're aware Iraq has some issues with protesters charging the U.S. Embassy. I'm glad it has not escalated. Iraq has been doing a great job about staying out of all these little conflicts. We don't want them to get involved in these conflicts. They need to stay on a straight and narrow. They've been doing a great job of this. Let's hope that continues. This would be good for both the dinar as well as the stocks. You put a mic in front of these parliament politicians and they instantly become economic experts. This is basic math. Finance committee. Discussion of 2025. Budget tables will begin next month, that is November. Why is that important? The rate. They are still settling out 2024 and 2023 now suddenly they are going. To be ready for 2025 and its tables? I believe. This tells us we will soon have a rate in order for them to fix those tables. On the news Alak came in and talked again about the deletion of the three zeros and he said we have a process to enhance the dinar. He was explaining how they are going to delete the three zeros and add value. Then this idiot comes on TV and he says to us dropping the zeros will not lead to a value increase. He's just a fool that hates this is happening. That's all Alak talked about, again saying it's under constant review. As far as the guy that comes out and says this is not good, that's it's negative, this is not being sent to you by Sadani. Don't pay attention to them, only pay attention to your true leader Sadani. Prime Minister Mohammad Shia al-Sadani expressed, on Thursday, Iraq's readiness to enter into a partnership with American companies in the oil industry sector, revealing at the same time his government's intention to establish a new Iraqi bank. This came during his participation in New York, can the news get any better? Finally the US is engaging Iraq and seriously taking on partnerships especially in the energy sector. So we know if the US is invested in Iraq something is up. The closer we get to this monetary reform, much more will be revealed. So much is already being revealed and put in print but as we get closer you will see so much more. The war is likely escalating in the Middle East. When Iran gets involved will this negatively affect the rate, the float? Emo the war is affecting more the relationships between counties in the Middle East. As far as it affecting the monetary reform of the Iraqi dinar that's in a sealed envelope figuratively speaking. It has nothing to do with the war. Once that envelope is opened, it would definitely, probably have some cause and effect on the float, in the basket. Because what countries are in those baskets? Yeah, the ones that might be affected but I don't think it'd be affected in a negative way. War has a tendency to, snap, speed things up. Thank you for watching.